And you have to tell Kamala Harris that we've had enough. We've had enough of you. You're a horrible vice president. You destroyed San Francisco as the DA. You destroyed California as the attorney general. You're not going to destroy the United States of America. Kamala, you're fired. Get out of here. Fired. We're not going to let him do it, Troy. We're not going to let her destroy our country. Today, I make you this promise. I will liberate Wisconsin and our entire nation from this mass migration invasion of murderers, drug dealers, gang members, and thugs. Going to be liberated. Going to liberate. I will support universal school choice. Very important. We will let federal education dollars follow the child instead of a propping up of a woke federal bureaucracy. And I will defend, I can't even believe I have to say this, I will defend parental rights. But under my plan, for the U.S. economy, American workers will no longer be worried about losing their jobs to foreign nations. Instead, foreign nations will be worried about losing their jobs to America because we're taking them back. Biden said that he and Kamala were, quote, singing from the same song sheet. She helped pass all the laws, every single one of them. She was a major player in everything we did. Now, he went up into the White House press secretary's lectern, and he said this stuff. And they were dying. <laughs> they were saying, oh, my God, it's coming down. There have obviously been a number of crises that the country has been facing over the past several days with the hurricane, with the port strike, with the situation in the Middle East. Can you talk about how your vice president, who is running for the presidency, has worked on these uh, crises and what role she has played over the past several days? Well, she's I'm in constant contact with her. She's aware we're we're all we're singing from the same song sheet. We uh, she helped pass the, all the laws that are being employed now. She was a major player in everything we've done including passage of uh, legislation which we were told we could never pass. And so she's been, uh, and her, her staff is interlocked with mine in terms of all the things we're doing.